performance. The final contest tonight is a welterweight contest between Yodnachar from Thailand and Ryan Redbeat Simpson. Uh, the fighter that's come into Thailand has really impressed the fans here of late. In fact, the last time I saw Ryan Simpson fight, he won convincingly by knockout. <laughs> Yeah, Ryan Simpson's a very hard fighter. Um, he's come up against top ranked boxers being here. He's had it tough. He's the world champion for the WPKL. Uh, he's from uh, Suriname, which is in the uh, Caribbean. So he's he's uh, one of the one of the top boys in the field. Definitely fighting out of Holland, he is number one. The last time I saw him fight at Lumpini, he won by knockout in the first round and he looked awesome. So let's see how Simpson goes tonight. He's up against a very, very skillful fighter though in Yodicha and uh, he's going to be really tested here today. And there's the crowd again, that 100,000 plus in front of the King's Palace to witness the elite of Muay Thai. Here we have Ryan Simpson does a very nice wide coup. Um, when for this fight, he flew in a couple of weeks ahead of the fight and prepared himself in uh, Pattaya at, at one of our gyms. And uh, he trained really hard for this fight. It uh, was quite important to him. He, especially after he made made his name with a with a first round knockout at Lumpini Stadium. Well, there's plenty of tattoos over him, as over his trainer, and uh, certainly would be a, a ferocious opponent to face up to if you're looking at um, looking down on on Ryan Simpson in the ring. Now into the centre they go. Round one is underway. Yadicha and Thailand on the left of the screen, and Ryan Simpson to the right. Well, Ryan's uh, Ryan's main strength is in his hands. He's got good hand speed. He's a very hard hitter. Whereas uh, Yadicha is uh, in his legs. He is an awesome leg kicker, and uh, he's sent many a victim to hospital with broken legs. Yadicha looking a little smaller than Simpson. Uh, that would mean that you probably want to keep away from Simpson in the grappling. Yeah, well the weights, they weighed in exactly the same weight. Uh, the difference is, Yod, if you look at the legs, at the top half of the legs of uh, Yod Dechar, they're massive. He has massive legs. Yod Dechar, known as the great kicker, up against the, one of the toughest and meanest fighters to come into Thailand for a long time. Well trained. And uh, he's a fighter that certainly doesn't lack anything in terms of power and strength. That's Simpson there with the tattoos. Yeah, I've, got, I've got a lot of respect for Simpson because uh, he'll go in the ring with anybody. He doesn't care and he'll go and he'll do his best. He won't lay down for nobody and he won't back off for nobody. The, the one thing that Simpson has against him is he has very tiny legs. When he comes up against a boxer like uh, Yod Dechar, Yod Dechar definitely is going to work on his legs. Yod Dechar now in the centre of the ring, sizing up Simpson here in the first round. Slips underneath that punch of Simpson's, and uh, Simpson, as you said, uh, certainly does pack a very powerful punch, and that's one thing that Yod Dechar will be watching at very carefully as he settles into this fight. Round one, often the probing round of Muay Thai. Uh, not a lot of action taking place here. Both fighters are just probing out, testing each other's strengths and weaknesses. Yeah, well, to get, to get a hit on points in the first round, you've virtually got to knock the opponent down. Without a knockdown, 90% uh, of the time, 99% of the time, it's, uh, it's a draw. Still a long way to go in this contest. We're only getting towards the end of round one, and uh, both fighters are just testing each other out at the moment. No major shots have been fired, although uh, Simpson is, looks like he's got his gun recoil and about to explode at any moment. You can see that uh, Yod Dechar has got a lot of respect for Simpson here. He's uh, keeping it very tidy and, and, and saying, and saying so uh, Simpson's got the same respect for Yod Dechar. It's a very tidy fight. Simpson there just poising his knee, about to let it strike it onto the chest of Yod Dechar, but he had second thoughts. I think Simpson's making a mistake here. He's going too hard on the first round. See, understand attempt how, by Yod Dechar. Yeah, uh, understanding how the referees think and the judges give the points is very important in Muay Thai. A lot of these guys come here and move out on the first round. If they don't knock them down, they've wasted the energy. They should be just feeling out, finding out what the weaknesses are and uh, save the steam for the second round. Well, certainly we expect fireworks to erupt here. I'm not talking about outside the ring, I'm talking about inside the ring because you can see that both these fighters are preparing for their tactics and the tactics are to go all out and win and expect the action to hot up 
as we move into the second round. There's uh, the corner of uh, Simpson and uh, uh, Yod Den Shai. They're, they're working very hard on each other. There's Ravi Char now. Center of the ring. Simpson unleashes two punches, then steps back. Deep push kick. Very fast. Simpson. Simpson is very fast. He is on the ball. Action. Perfect up uppercut followed up by a leg kick. He, he's going to hurt Yod Den Shai. He's, he's coming in okay. Simpson on the attack. Punches. Look at that. Then, uh, then unfortunately for him, as he fired out that roundhouse kick, Yod Dichar saw it coming and grabbed it, and therefore upset um, Simpson. He fell on his back. This is only one one of the only weaknesses Simpson has is he he tends to have a lot of problems with balance and and getting like pushed Sanctuary over. Almost. Yeah, like Santino, he's always being pushed over. Okay, but, uh, and again, yeah. Simpson and uh, Yod Dichar putting the pressure on the Simpson now in the second round. He strike by Simpson oh, got through. Oh. And he's and a response with punches by Yod Dichar. Yod Dichar now. Yod Dichar is trying to keep his distance with a Simpson. teeth, a push kick. In well, Thai we call this kick the teeth, which is a, a push kick. It's used to kick, uh, create distance between the opponents. And I've seen it used as an aggressive weapon also for the pits. One of those great um, weapons of Muay Thai. Jabs now by Simpson. He does throw a beautiful punch, doesn't he, Simpson? Yeah, Simpson, is, is, his hands are very good. Uh, he's done a lot of work on his hands lately. He's been practicing his grappling. He's been grappling with the ties to, to get ready for this fight. He knew that uh, that uh, Yod Dei Cha is, is a very strong and hard boxer, so he, he, he put his time in on the grappling, uh, knowing that he has to work on his feet work as well. Look at that upper legs of Yod Dei Cha. You know, if he ever gets the chance to really go smashing in with those legs, I'm sure he's going to do so. He must pack one of the strongest roundhouse kicks in the competition. And he's Yod Dei Cha now. Sizing up Simpson, Simpson standing back, punches. Now the grapple's on. Let's see who's going to win the distance streak. It's into a stun on my pity though with the referee breaks. Simpson standing back. You can definitely see the size. Look at the size of the legs of Yod Den Chai. Huge. He, he, uh, he's taken out many opponents in the first round. Uh, I've never seen him go more than three rounds with a European. Yod Den Chai now moving in on to Simpson. Testing him out. Fires out the roundhouse kick. Simpson stands back a little. Yod Den Chai stalking. If Simpson can get this on and go the distance with Yod Den Yod Den Char, he is there, really Yod good. Char. Look at that, these, these two, they, they got respect for each other. They're not scared, they're both, no one's stepping back. Simpson says, I've come here to fight. Yod Den Char says, I'm not going anywhere either. Yod Den Char, testing Simpson at the moment with those roundhouse kicks. Getting in close, Simpson stands back a little now. Yod Den Char sizing him up, moves forward, stalking. Simpson stands back, moves back slightly. And uh, you, you sort of get the impression that Yod Char is just waiting for his right opportunity to attack on the Simpson. Well, end of the round. Yod, Yod Den Char knows that uh, Simpson is one of the best in, the, in, in his weight division, and he's got the respect for him for that as well. So I think you can see that uh, he doesn't want to do anything stupid and risk taking one of those right hooks. What's the background of Simpson? Where does he hail from? Well, Simpson comes out of uh, the Caribbean, and uh, is training in Holland and he comes across to Thailand quite often and brushes up on his training. He uh, holds numerous titles. Look at him, look at him move out, isn't he? He looks, he looks very tidy here. Jab with the punches again goes Simpson. There's that roundhouse kick of Yodichar. Yodichar punches now onto Simpson. Simpson Simpson's follows up very the uppercuts. Tidy with the hands. Uppercuts he's very and he's tidy. pushing back onto Yodichar. Yodichar a bit of... Whoa, there's now. a good knee. There's a good knee there, Patrick. Excellent knee by Simpson. Well, he's taking the fight of the Yodichar at the moment. Yodichar, a little bit surprised there maybe by the resilience of Simpson to come back under pressure. Well, this round, this elbow round. Elbow by oh, Simpson. Good, good fly. Nice that hammer. Hammer of that elbow came right down on the head of, of the Yodi Char. But Yodi Char uh, responds um, away from the, the, uh, the, the danger area. And uh, But nevertheless, you, you look at this fight, you think that Simpson is really coming up. Well, if he, if he can moment. keep the pace on like this, this round is his. The last round's not. The last round definitely goes to Yod Dan Shizer's. Simpson got thrown around a little bit, but uh, he's had a good round so far. Simpson. But this round is, is Simpson's. So far, this round is Simpson's. Yod Char under a bit of pressure from Simpson in the second round. Flashes out very head by kick. Oh, oh! Knee strike attempt by Simpson, but couldn't quite get the the, uh, the target area. Then he pushes Yod Char back onto the ropes. Yod Char 
into the center of the ring. What Simpson's lacking is the understanding of how the referees and judges think and uh, in the scoring of the points. You can't just come in and punch and kick and punch and kick and think you're going to win the fight. He's, he's got to start... Uh, yeah, he's got to start dominating and uh, using a, a, a good variation of technique. Also, what it got, the foreign fighters come out here and they don't score very many points with the knees and yet that is high scoring in the way yes, the knees, are, the knees are, are the good scoring and definitely if, if you're throwing on the ground and, and throwing around the judge sees the, the person doing the throw is the more dominant and I suppose also what they often say is in, in the end it's the fighter who's deemed to be the ringmaster is yes, the winner yes. and the ringmaster also obviously includes skill so you have to also look at who are the judges and referees some judges like uh, techniques some judges like this boot strength and guts. I suppose if you've been all round putter, you'd probably go for the middle road. Uh, you know, a bit yeah, of skill, well, bit of domination, strength. Uh, it's the all round fighter that probably would be, would be seem to be the superior fighter. Yeah, this round so far is definitely uh, Simpson Red Beats. It's, de it's definitely Ryan Simpson's. Simpson. Oh, whoa, that it off very now, close, Roddy very Char. close. Roddy Char, under a little bit of pressure from Simpson. He's been stalked and hunted here in this third round. And as we go into round four, Rodney uh, Char is going to have to fight all the way. Oh, yes, definitely, definitely. That's the end of the third round. We're coming into the fourth round now. And uh, I, I, that round was definitely Simpsons. But if I look at this fight, I see the first round as a draw. Second round was definitely Yod Dan Shai's. And the third round, definitely Simpson. So I call it a equal points at the moment. The next two rounds are going to be the deciding factor. Can Simpson pull it off? Can he play at the tie game? Can he convince the judges that he can do it the tie way? And also, is he fit enough? Uh, he's just thrown into this contest, so maybe Yodichar will have the advantage with fitness with one and two more rounds remaining. Yodichar firing into those roundhouse kicks, and back goes Simpson reeling under those strikes at the moment by Yodichar. Yodichar turning up the heat here in round four. Simpson, they're both turning the heat up here. Just uh, Simpson's got to make sure he's got his balance and everything nice and neat so he doesn't get thrown around the ring. This is where he loses on points with the judges. He's got to realise that the, the punching doesn't gain too much uh, too much um, influence over the judges in the high boxing. Yodicha certainly looking very strong now as he moves into Simpson. Simpson unleashing a lot of punches. Now into the grapple, test his strength. Yodicha holds his weight against Simpson. He very good knee, very good at all. As the knee strikes of Simpson are trying to get through. And Yodicha though is looking quite competent, quite tidy at the moment as Simpson realizes that this is the crucial round. Yes, this is a, oh, the, there see, is. this is the problem. This There's is the problem again. there, yeah. So obviously uh, Simpson under pressure now. Uh, maybe when he's under pressure, he finds the balance a bit hard to maintain uh, with his physique the way it is. And now Yodi Char is keeping the pressure on with those low leg kicks. Oh, there it is How again. There it is again. Hard kicks, those kicks of Yodi Char. See, the other thing is Simpson's got to get up faster. If he doesn't get up fast, the judges really look at it as a knockdown. But uh, when, when uh, they get bounced back up, the judges tend to think of it as a slip. But they still are very powerful kicks, though. Oh, that, was, that, was a, that was a wicked kick. I mean, I, if I was uh, judging, I would say that you get to get top points for those sort of kicks. They're, they're annihilated. As Yodi Char now moves into Simpson. Simpson backing off slightly now. He's under pressure. Yodi Char turning up the heat. Comes in on to He's Simpson. working on Simpson's legs there. Powerful kicks of Yodi Char. One of the meanest Here it kicks goes. Here it comes again. You watch. He's setting him up for a good leg kick again. Yodi Char looking dangerous here in the fourth round. Knee strike oh. by Simpson. Referee says fight on. There's a low lift. There it is kick. again. There it is now again. Simpson. This is going Yodenshire's way. Yodenshire now, I'd say uh, Sifu would be ahead on points. Um, and it's looking a little bit grim now for Simpson. He's got to do something a bit special now to salvage this round. Simpson needs to do more road work. He's got to really toughen those legs up and get that balance, work on that balance. Certainly in terms of skills of punching, he's probably as good as I've ever seen. But oh, he's one of the best. He's one of the best. There's that low leg kick again by Yodi Char. Working on it. He's, he's been unrelenting with those low leg kicks for the, for the entire four rounds. He's just been, he's had a fight plan, and that is to kick the tall timber down, and it's worked. 
Simpson's making a few mistakes here. He's relying on his punching power to survive it. It doesn't work like that. Let's pick up the slow motion of the fourth round. There's those low leg kicks of Yodichar. There they go again. Powerful yeah, kicks. They're definitely oh. knocked out. They're definitely they knocked out. I'd almost give that a countdown on that one. Yeah. Almost well, unless he's injured down. and he can't get up. And normally the, the referee will give him at least two seconds to make an effort to get up. There it goes again. All that force to the Simpson. He got out of the way of that low leg kick with their powerful yeah. kicks. That deep they, push kick. And there's that low leg kick right under the side of the thigh. Must be very powerful. Coming, Those in, sort of kicks. coming into the last round now, Patrick. But that round definitely was uh, Yodden Shah's. Uh, so Yodden Shah's in the lead here now. Who, 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 I'd say that Simpson might be almost even knocked down Yodden Shah if he's going to be certain of winning this contest yeah, because he's, he's behind on points. Either that, he, he might have a chance to bring it up to a close to split decision or he, if he can win unanimously on the last round. Yodhi Char in the box seat, one more round remaining, Simpson being hunted and kicked down several times by Yodhi Char in the third and fourth round, particularly that fourth round, that was really the turning point, in the fourth round uh, the, the fight was up for the grabbing. Oh, got something wrong, got something wrong with the glove, what's wrong there? It's like uh, oh, his glove slipping off, Simpson's glove did come off slightly, now he's back into the fray again. But that fourth round, I think, was a turning point, uh, Sidney. That was really the, when the, the fight could have gone one way or the other. It was Yodi Chara came with those sweeping leg kicks. Simpson's coming back strong. He still feels it. He thinks he can take this. I need a knockdown, though. Right? Yeah, he'll definitely, definitely need to knock him down to get this one because uh, that's a tough assault. You can't win just on punching with basic leg kicks. You've got to have more in your time. Yodi Chara standing back there slightly from Simpson. Simpson realizing that the fight is almost over for him. He's got to make his move and make it quickly. In he comes, punching, looking for the leg grab if he gets the opportunity. Yod then charged very smart. He's using the teeth or the push kick to keep uh, Simpson at bay. Keeps, makes makes uh, Yod then Char look like the teacher and uh, Ryan Simpson, the student. He's saying, you, you'll come in when I let you come in and that's it. Well, I suppose when you've got the points advantage, you can afford to be a little cocky. And that's exactly what Yod Char is doing at the moment. He's, He's basically going into a cruise mode. He's not going to take any risks. And, uh, he's going to make Simpson do all of the point scoring if he wants to do so. Well, he knows he's won now. If he can get through this round and, and, and uh, make Simpson make, make Simpson keep Simpson at his distance, he knows he's won. So that's that's what he's doing now. He's using his jab and his push kick. And, oh, there was an elbow. Simpson oh, going one more time. Elbow there. Simpson realizing that the fight is almost gone. He will, he's going to have one last desperate attempt to knock down Yodicha here in the final seconds of this fifth round. You know, if this, fought, if this fight was fought in Europe, uh, the judges would go on Simpson's side because they're more more into the punching than, and that, than, than uh, ties, whereas the ties are over the total package, the total deal. So, and when I look at this fight, I see Yodden Shai so far is definitely... Uh, I'd say you're right there. ...is going to win here, but uh, in Europe, this could go a different way. If you're talking in international boxing, if he's points to score, they'll be punched in this fight. Yes, certainly, but a lot of those punches, uh, Yodden Shai is not one bit of two by them. He's yeah, no, it's not, it's not affecting him at all. But what I'm saying is that in, in places like Holland and Europe, the judges are more influenced in the handwork because most of them are converted international boxing judges. Mm. Mm. Well, let's see what happens here in the final seconds of round five. A brave performance by Simpson, but uh, on the bell I think you'll find that Yodicha almost oh, 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 and he has been given the verdict. It, it wasn't Yodicha quite enough. Points. It wasn't quite enough. Very, very close decision. I'd say 49-48. I'd say split, split decision. We're seeing these two fighters fight again. I'd like to thank you, Super Robert. I look forward to your company at ringside again soon. Yes, thank you too, Patrick Kusak. That was a great night.